our students are able to interact with uh, the Texas A&M Kingsville faculty and staff, as well as their students, and participate in uh, the Ag Olympics events. So the students will take uh, things like uh, Wilbro races, uh, tug of war, and different things just to really build some camaraderie and some uh, opportunities for us to really tour the A&M campus and really kind of feel part of it. And so tomorrow we'll tour the campus and meet with advisors and uh, different faculty in the agriculture department. So it's really a good opportunity to bring more students up to Texas A&M Kingsville, as well as open the uh, horizon of my students in, in San Antonio Palo Alto Junior College. We have students that uh, were former Palo Alto students that are now uh, leadership positions here at, at Texas A&M Kingsville. And so for us, our students to see them as leaders, as leaders and be able to interact with them is really important. You know, a lot of times they do college tours and things of that sort, but being actually in Ag Olympics gives an opportunity to really be on a team and be hands-on and really experience the college life and experience what they'll be doing when they come to Texas A&M Kingsville the next year. So I'm on the rodeo team. I've been on the rodeo team for about three years. I don't compete, but I love being a part of the team, and that's what the rodeo team brought to me and helped for me to be involved in my school. And I've been on the rodeo team for three years now. I was a transfer student my sophomore year. It's a lot of fun. I'm actually, I'm the secretary for the team, so of course I have lots of things that I have to organize, make sure that our teams are registered for the Ag Olympics, and we always look forward to it every year.